sports, drugs, entertainment. As um, far as basketball is concerned, have you ever won any competitions or trophies, championships, slam dunk contests, anything like that? Several slam dunk contests. Trophies as well. Where'd you win the slam dunk contest at? Jersey, California, anywhere I've been, South Carolina, Georgia. So what other states have you played basketball in besides New Jersey? Um, name them all if you can. Or other places. South Carolina. It was L.A. Washington. Washington. Washington, D.C. or Washington State? Washington State. Have you ever played outside the U.S.A.? Yes, played in Mexico. Who'd you play in Mexico, Mexico for? Central America. Who'd you play for? Uh, one time was one squad was called Carmen, uh, Mexico City for two years. I played for Cancun and Cozumel as well. City called Medida. Few of them, lots of them. It's, it's a lot of them. They were playing three years over there, but it amounted to six. It amounted to six seasons. You get two seasons in like one year. You get the regular season, and then you get the tournament season. That's actually how I made it over there during the tournament season. So where were you playing at to go play in Mexico? Where were you playing out of? Well, I went to a college in, in Los Angeles, Los Angeles Valley College. Played there two years, and I was a little older than the guys that I went to college with, so I just... Tried to get off into, you know, making some money at it. And I started in a Larry Drew League and a Magic Johnson League out there. You know, the Shore League, Venice Beach, you know, the whole circuit. And what year was this, roughly? I started that. I started my college. I started again playing college in Los Angeles at nine, in 1992. And finished in ninety, finished school in ninety four, and I played another another year or so in the leagues with Magic Johnson, Larry Drew, and all of these other you know pro level leagues. Do you know anyone who made it to the um, NBA? Yes, I know a few people. One of my best friends, starting from in Montclair, New Jersey, his name was Mark Bryant. Good friend of mine played for the Portland Trail Blazers. Still to this day is part of the NBA as far as coaching. What year did he play for the Blazers? Uh, roughly. Roughly, I would say 88, something like that. Do you know anyone else who played or made it to the NBA? Personally? Yes. Mm. Yeah, I know, a few, I know a few guys from out in I'm out in California. Yeah. Can I know, name him? I know a guy named Anthony Franks. You know, rest in peace to the brother. He's a good friend of mine. He played for the uh, Charlotte Hornets. He was actually number two scoring in the league twice in a year behind J Michael Jordan. Have you ever played against any NBA players, like in summer leagues, uh, leagues out the country, or anything like that? Yeah. Pickup games? Yeah. Uh, Paul Pierce, Jalen Rose, uh, the Davis brothers, Antonio and Dale Davis. We used to play against them at, at UCLA. That was part of Magic Johnson's thing right there. Okay. And, um, and don't, I can't forget, rest in peace to the brother, the late, great Kobe Bryant. Where'd you play with him at? Balboa Park in Canoga Park, California. Okay. Um, name some players from, you know, the old school, the 80s and 90s that you think were underrated, that were never mentioned in the conversation with the quote-unquote greats, the Larry Birds, the Magic Johnsons, and Dr. J's and things like that. There's many of them. I don't know what, where, where to start. It was so many of them. Just give us one or two. Uh, I'll always start uh, 
Wow, that's deep, man. That's deep. There's so many, I don't know where to start. Well, just pick one. Okay. I would say... Uh, brother named Bobby Jones used to play for the Philadelphia 76ers. What position, you remember? Power forward. And you thought he was underrated or never mentioned in the conversations? Yeah. I mean, not mentioned enough, I would say more. Not mentioned enough. Um, what's your professional basketball team? What, what's your favorite team or your team? At this moment, the uh, New York Knicks. So you say at this moment, who else do you like or who else do you support? Team or, or as an individual? Team. Uh, actually, I, you know, I, I support them all because, you know, there's on each team, there's somebody I like to watch and, and to learn from as well. How long have you been a New York Knicks fan? Uh, Roughly. Uh, I, I, I will say probably about 30 years, man. Okay, so who did you like before the New York Knicks? Philadelphia 76ers and the San Antonio Spurs because they had both of my favorite players, Dr. J and George Gervin, the Iceman, which is, you know, we all know what happens there. The Iceman. So how is the Iceman um, relative to you? Well, actually, he's my—he's one of my two favorite players. Like I said, his name is George Gervin, and I love what I loved about him is he could play with either hand. You know, he could shoot a jump shot with either hand, and he was just—you uh, know—he was just masterful at what he did. Masterful. So, did you take part of his name for your own name? I actually did, yes, but I also had an uncle who named me Ice Cream. And as a little kid, he named me Ice Cream. But once I got older and and like that, you know, I changed up Ice Cream to Ice. And it also went along with him being my favorite player as well because we shared the same number, number 44. Hmm. Do you watch any other sports besides basketball? If so, what? And who's your teams? Football, baseball. No, I, 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 all, and I love the Yankees. I have love for the Mets, but basketball. I even look at a little tennis. 